friends welcome back to the channel today we have another homemaking motivational video in today's video we're going to be cleaning I also have some new products I want to show you I have a thrift haul that I'm excited about so if you're into these types of videos guys keep on watching hi guys welcome back to the channel or welcome to the channel my name is Ashley if you're new here and today we have another home update vlog I'm gonna do a vlog style I'm gonna show you guys the things that we are doing in the house we're gonna do some cleaning I gotta show you guys a thrift haul so it's gonna be very exciting so make sure you're staying tuned let me know in the comments where you are watching I had a lot of love on my other video and I just want to know where you guys are watching from I live here in the beautiful city of Pensacola Florida let me know if we are city mates I do want to build a community that's my goal this year 2024 so let me know where you're from in the comments and yeah let's get to cleaning y'all because I did not clean this house last night when I went to bed my husband cooked so I was supposed to clean but I'm gonna bed like at 8 30 and I have on um, cleaning clothes okay I didn't I do not dress up for cleaning videos maybe a clean and decorate maybe you guys will see something festive but for just a regular clean this is what you're gonna get that's what you're gonna get let's get it so here is an overview of the kitchen area guys a hot mess i mean hot mess just yeah and then this area my husband was doing some work so i didn't update you guys on his job find he did find one and it's a work from home job so that's crazy but now we both work from home so that's his stuff we're gonna figure that out and here's an overview of the living room we were watching lion king 2 last night so we were all coated up on the couch and it's not that bad and then here's over here this little area we're gonna be kind of redecorating this stuff so this is the hall bath in its current state it needs to be cleaned it's really not much going on but you can see the toilet it needs to be cleaned so we're gonna do that and yeah is about to die so what I'm gonna do is just wipe down the counters real quick and I'm gonna sweep in here and then I'm gonna show you guys the thrift haul okay so um and then we'll do other stuff but I just want to charge it up real quick but life is a winding road no telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Let me figure out where the road goes Even if I'm falling down I will keep on searching for my highs Say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head. 
So y'all, I am sweaty. <laughs> I tried to do a lot of stuff while this camera was charging. So I'm gonna show you guys what I did. And then we're gonna clean the bathroom. And then I'm gonna show you guys the thrift haul and some home updates. All right. Here is the table. Um, I just cleaned everything off. I put all my husband's stuff up. And then I have some plants over here who are struggling a little bit. So I brought them from upstairs to downstairs. And I have this one over here. And my plan, y'all, my plan with these plants is to have a bookshelf my arch bookshelf can y'all visualize it an arch bookshelf and yeah and i'll be able to put my plants and my trinkets and little stuff like that on there we will be painting probably in the next couple of days we're going to be painting the whole downstairs so um that's why i haven't really put anything on the wall but anyways but yeah so let me show you guys um the kitchen so i cleared off everything from the kitchen i swept really good i don't know what, what can i get to get this off my son decided to write on my stools i do have some of that awesome spray and i sprayed it and it did not come off so y'all let me know what else i could use or should i even worry about it because i mean it's kids and whatever i don't know so i did have a child that woke up <laughs> he's just chilling but I'm, I'm going to vacuum the floor i did move everything off the couch and then we're going to wipe down this mirror i don't know if you can see it that good but it got some little fingerprints on it not too bad for a toddler and school age kids but anyways i'm gonna vacuum and then we're gonna get into this bathroom to keep it nice and clean not freak out and cause a scene i try to hold it together keep it together not sure who i really am just be cute and super bland i try to hold it together keep it together been playing it down but i'm so getting tired now won't you meet Also, we'll be using this pink stuff to clean the bathroom with. I got both of these from Home Depot. Um, I'm gonna splurge, but um, yeah, so I'm gonna be using just this spray. I'm not gonna use this stuff because I think this is for like hard, gunky places. I don't know. Is that you can use it for a lot of places? Showers, garden furniture, paintwork, boats, saucepans, cooker tops, all that kind of stuff. So this is more of like a spring clean product. I already used this before, so did a pretty good job did what it's supposed to do and so that's what we're going to be using for the bathroom i don't know if you guys know about the scrubbing bubble toilet cleaner brush you can put these little pads on there and they're flushable and then that's what i use to clean the inside of the toilet and so i used to use the other one where you put it in the trash but this is better because you can flush it down the toilet i don't know that's just better for me all right, so the bathroom is cleaned. Um, I just wiped everything down with the pink stuff spray. I put fresh towel for drying their hands. And then the toilet is really cleaned, no ring. <laughs> so the plan for this bathroom is to be a moody bathroom. So we're going to put wallpaper, change out the mirror, change out the light fixtures. I don't know if I'm gonna do away with this pedestal because it doesn't bother me. I do wish it was a little higher, you know? But um, other than that, I think we're gonna save money by not messing with that. But we may, I don't know, we may or may not. So this is just the start of it, but um, it's clean. And this bathroom gets used a lot. So uh, I just wanted to give it a little, a little cleaning, a little sprucing. It's really no decor in here at all. So here's an overview of the hall. I also have some stuff on the other side I'm going to show you guys as well. Now, I didn't get this from the thrift store. I got this from Dollar General. And I was like, okay, Dollar General. They have a Black History line now. So this is the Black Paper Party um, line. And I thought this was super cute. Even though I'm not a purse girly, I do like, little, you know, little sacks and stuff like that. So little totes. And I also wanted to support them. So there you go. They had all kind of stuff in there. So I am going to do a little reel on all the things that they had at the Dollar General. But this is the thing that I picked up.
Moving on to the thrifted stuff, um, I got some books, so I'm gonna show you guys that. But this is what I'm really excited about, is these plates, um, they're $5.99. And then I got these glasses, they were $7.99, basically a dollar a piece. I could have got these from the Dollar Tree, but you also get the basket and I don't know, I got them all in one spot. So I'm in a mood to decorate my table and have table settings, and so I just wanted to start by buying plates and glasses and little whatnots like that. So here are the books that I got for Levi. This one, Green Eggs and Ham, we read this last night. I already probably have that book, but um, y'all listen. I have so much stuff to unpack, so I just went and got that. I thought he would like that. I also got this Junior Cookbook. We love cookbooks around here, especially like kids' cookbooks really fun I got this Ripley's Believe It or Not book you know just to engage the kids and then when I was there somebody told me I should read this so I picked this book up it's about foster care and you guys know that I work with foster children now or foster families and I also got this a sister is the nicest friend you can have now I thought this would be cute in the girls room when I do their room it's gonna be like light shades of pink I thought this would be really pretty for their room over here, I got this lamp, y'all. This lamp was $7.99. It looks really good quality. And so I'll be putting this upstairs. We're gonna be doing like a command center. And that leads me to this. I got this for like the kids, you know, homework and stuff like that. I'm gonna be spray painting it. I'm not a red girl. I just don't really like a lot of reds. Um, but I do like pops of red. But anyways, I'm gonna paint this another color and we're gonna do a whole upstairs command center. So you guys stay tuned for that. I got this lamp the other day and I spray painted it, but I messed it up. But it's been plugged up in here. It's been plugged up here since I got it. But yeah, I thought it was really cute and I'm gonna like fix this little area up. Um, I wanna create moments in the house, like little moments here and there. And I thought this lamp would be super cute in the kitchen. Just, you know, give it a little bit more, you know, cozy feel. I got this table from the teen thrift store and it was a lot of nice stuff in there. Um, and so I was like, oh, I'm gonna grab this table and I painted it and I put this uh, fabric on it. It had this glass already on it and I'm gonna make a moment over here. It's gonna be a moment. <laughs> I just got to figure out what I want to do. I'm starting to go more retro and more like, you know, funky. I just want some pieces in there that give the home some character. And so, yeah, that's what um, I bought. So we'll see how that's turned out. I just got my plan up there for right now. This is really, I just set it there and then I haven't moved it, but I will be decorating this little area a little bit better in future videos. All right, guys, so we're gonna be closing out the vlog. Um, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today, trying to get some things done before these kids wake up. Listen, I had one wake up, the rest of them are still sleeping, and my kitchen will stay clean because we eat out on Saturday, so today is Saturday, and yeah, so I won't be cooking, so that's a good thing about that. Um, don't you hate when you have to like clean, then cook, and then clean again? That's crazy, but we're not doing that today. I give myself a break. I delegate the day for no cooking for myself. Unless my husband wants to grill and stuff like that, he'll do that. But for the most part, we eat out on Saturdays. My next video is gonna be laundry motivation. We're gonna do some spring cleaning. We're gonna do a whole series on spring cleaning. Really for me, it's not really deep cleaning. It's like organization, getting in the garage, organizing that, like getting all the stuff like sorted because we're still brand new in this house. So it's not really super dirty, but you know, we need to organize a little bit better. So those are future videos. So you need to stick around. You gotta subscribe to the channel if you wanna see those. Turn your notification bells on and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.